three, uh, die, in, uh, go. Nice. <laughs> Very well done. I like it. And they're off. The ball is thrown in. Hello, Good ladies job. and gentlemen, and welcome to ISGP 2020. You finally got him here, everyone. James Jones is back for her tournament. And oh, James Jones is in this round? Screw that, I'm out. Uh, <laughs> oh! oh <laughs> he's gone. <laughs> he's seen again. He's being he's being sarcastic because he joined specifically because of <laughs> James Jones being here. Uh, so, uh, yeah, yeah he so it's a race in uh, uh, Spyro 2 to 100% Zephyr um, Scorch and then to uh, get the to complete the base challenge in Shady Oasis. So. Um, that's it. We are we have our competitors here. They are James Jones and Blow Skiall, aka Lucas Bolton, aka Blowjob Mosquito. And joining me today are uh, Mr. Game Sendy, uh, Insomniac Anvil, and Yes Wally One. And this is a British Isle speedrun. This is the first time in both OAS and OSGP history that we've had um, people from all constituent countries of the United Kingdom as well as the Independent Republic of Ireland uh, joining uh, for a call. So Brexit yeah. may have happened, but we're all friends here. Sadly, yeah, yeah. we cannot so, uh, be united. <laughs> yep. Yeah. I'm glad uh, that uh, we're independent, and soon everything will be independent, including Scotland. It'll be uh, a lot of fun. So, <laughs> yes. Um, anyway. <laughs> or so, King Europe has a problem with Scottish independence. Yes, he does. Yeah, I, yeah, I noticed. Um, but uh, it's really just uh, the romantic in me just wants, uh, you know, Scotland to be free and Ireland to be united. But I know there's a lot of logistical issues uh, issues behind that. Um, but yeah, James, thank you very much for that Welsh countdown. Uh, Welsh, those numbers sounded quite similar to Irish, uh, actually. So it was kind of like, oh, yeah, I kind of see that. Because uh, tree, same in, in Irish, tree. And Game Cindy also says, uh, Connor says, also says tree in English. So, um, yeah, it's um, very similar. Um, James, do you speak Welsh fluently? Oh, no, no, no. Well, uh, it's, uh, uh, it's something I, uh, certainly don't speak uh, Welsh, no. Good. Ah. Fair enough. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, because um, I know a lot of the Welsh population do, uh, but I guess it depends on where you live, uh, naturally. So, um, yeah, that's fair. Um, oh, yes, Wally One has left. Okay, fair he's enough. Uh, he, he won. Yeah. He, um, he's already finished the challenge and he's well, gone. It's uh, kind of yeah. like Scotland now. We have Gaelic, <laughs> but not many of us speak it. So not <laughs> set up. Yeah. Yeah, it's yeah, it's funny because like a, you know the, the few times I've been to, to Scotland, I've seen it written on signs. I can actually, I can, I'm actually able to read it uh, because it's obviously it derives from um, uh, Middle Irish. Yeah, uh, old, old Irish, I should say. So old, old they are like the same or something like that. Yeah, you see it when the signs go for Scotland. Yeah, it, and uh, yeah, so I and I'm able to like understand a bit of it too, uh, which is really cool. Uh, so it's kind well, of like, cool. I like it. That's cool. Yeah, right. because it, it's so similar to like I've even seen clips of people speaking it, and I can I can pick up like kind of what they're saying because it is still very similar to um, to what is Irish Gaelic uh, today. Um, you know, they they split off in the early kind of like 11th century, I think, is when they started to diverge a bit. Which in linguistical terms isn't too much of um, like a split if you think about how like Latin. Um, kind of split in like the fourth century, fifth century kind of vibe. So um, yeah, so yeah. So there you go. There's a fucking boring language. I'm sure fucking MP Carlson, if he's making boring. a highlights video, he's gonna fucking put that as like a boring uh, <laughs> clip, like he did for me when I talked about um, when I talked about Brexit in, in the last tournament. Brexit but, uh, happened. Silence. Yeah. All right. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Was Brexit was getting so boring. Yeah. Coronavirus had to overtake it. I'm doom and doom. Good stuff. Exactly. <laughs> I, I, I found my yeah uh, my political uh, machinations interesting. Well, sure, look, that's just me. Uh, anyway, uh, James, how are you getting on in the speed run? Um, I uh, I, I am going into uh, uh, skill of spreadlines now. Okay. Um. Uh, how many? I don't know. That, need to get. Does that make sense? Five hundred gems. gems right? a lot. Ah, okay. Help. Makes sense. Okay, cool. Um, uh, and definitely skills bad ones is the best level to do that, and I would say. Cool. Yeah, good shout. Okay, grand. Uh, perfect. Uh, cool. Um, so yeah, good stuff. And you're in scales bad ones yourself as well, uh, Mr. Bolden. Um, I'm in uh, squats now. I'll 
Oh shit, fuck me, wow. <laughs> nice. I'm hoping, this is, I'm hoping this one goes a wee bit better than the last one. Although I actually enjoyed the last one, to be fair. Yeah, last one was good. Yeah, and yeah, at least you got you got two cracks at it, and you did better in the second go. So you got a bit of Spyro three experience it, it, under your belt, if you will. So it shows that the, good. the practice for it really helps. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, um, which is yeah, yeah, one hundred percent. It it does. Um, but yeah, uh, sure. Look, it was it was fun. Uh, I really enjoyed the commentary as well. That was uh, a great crack. And uh, yeah, good to good to have you back, James. Um, Good old man. This this is your first run of the tournament. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, Uh, it's your first run of the tournament. So hopefully you have a few more. And maybe you can race Charm Sky tomorrow. And uh, we'll get you maybe set up uh, with Azra, uh, Lucky as well. And um, yeah, then you'll be yeah you'll be flying. Um, Alice is kind of around ish, I guess. Uh, oh, and then of course James, your your epic rematch with uh, Fraser, aka oh, Chromon. Yeah. <laughs> the funny thing is, like I think Alice was wanting to do races yesterday, but it never happened. So we'll uh, just wait and see what happens with that. Hopefully, she wants yeah. to do a race. Point. Yeah, I, he's have plenty of time, I think. Uh, but we've been we've been very good, uh, I think, all, all groups and trying to arrange. So, um, so that's good. Uh, it's probably, been going well, yeah. That really has. Yeah, definitely. It has been, yeah. Um, I'm going to credit Ratchet Five and I with that. I'm just gonna say, <laughs> I think we've uh, been trying to kick people into gear, but uh, he's have all been diligent, which is good as well. So, um, so yeah, it's uh, been a fun tournament. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Absolutely. So yeah, a fun tournament so far. And um, sorry, excuse me, uh, burping because I just finished my uh, takeaway meal. Uh, thank you very much. Is it fish and chips? Uh, it was fish and chips actually. So uh, oh, that's hell good. yeah. Yeah, yeah. Fish and chips, as uh, Connor would say. Fish and chips. Fish and. I say, oh, yeah. I'm not from Jerry. Fish and chips. Fish, fish and chips, as uh, Connor and Gordon Irish uh, fellow would say. Yep. <laughs> Are you having no, tacos isn't. for dinner? Ah, uh, I'm not having. I'm having tacos for dinner. Uh, yeah, I, I, I had cheese <laughs> to make tacos, uh, Anvil. They were good. They were oh, good. Fuck yeah. Love to try them. Um, we'll, post you, we'll send you some to New Zealand. Oh, like <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, but they totally won't be gone off by then. Like, <laughs> yeah, the postage oh, for this coronavirus going on will take a while. Yeah. yeah, just have it expressed. It's all good. As uh, said, you should visit Ireland, and then you can visit Connor in Monaghan, and then he can make you uh, tuckers. You know, honestly, I'd absolutely love to do that at some point. I do seriously plan on visiting in the near future so good man yeah you should yeah that would be great um 100 um yeah that'd be that'd be super fun so yeah i uh, hope that happens and uh you can visit me with connor um lyle that's about it really i guess <laughs> it's, uh, oh, Sam, 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 Sam. Hello, hey, well, we just call him. Call him yeah, yeah, he's not part of the community exactly anymore, but he's kind of like an orbiter, if you will, or an associate, uh, perhaps. So, um, mm-hmm. and uh, um, yeah, that'd be pretty cool. Um, similar, yeah, Ireland and New Zealand are quite similar uh, in, in many respects. I think I think similar populations as well. Um, kind of similar even I think kind of climates in a sense um like we don't have any you have volcanoes on New Zealand isn't that true yeah yeah we have uh yeah, you quite got a few of them. Yeah, you've always got the yeah. fear that something's gonna erupt yeah. yeah pretty much like all yeah. of New Zealand just pretty much is on top of two major fault lines that are constantly uh rubbing booties together they are not uh respecting the social distancing those fault um, lines uh, so they're breaking the uh, the COVID rules. Uh, really? So we're looking into that. Yeah, I think we actually had a volcano go off a couple months back, and it, yeah. uh, some tourists died. So that sucked. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. I remembered because um, I think I muscle memoried the whole thing. I was like, oh yeah, that I because I read about that. So yeah, uh, R.I.P. to the um, tourists. So um, I indeed. Moment yeah. of silence. Yeah, uh, nah, nah, we, we won't. <laughs> I think the moment's gone, to be fair. Yeah, um, what was I going to say to Zed? Um, I was going to say, I can't remember what I was going to I'll think of it later. Um, but, oh yeah, no, I remember what I was going to say to you now. Uh, how are you feeling about Jacinda's uh, response to COVID? It seems like you're the one country in the world that's fucking got it 
pretty fucking yeah, good. It's, oh, it's actually so good. Um, yeah, I think we um, went to level two pretty much immediately, and then after two weeks, Jacinda cranked it to level three, uh, which is basically kind of like, hey, um, like everyone needs to you know start sorting out your shit. The whole country was in panic for like a couple of weeks, and people were stockpiling toilet paper and all that kind of stuff. It was kind of a bit manic, and everyone was getting a bit scared. And then uh, we went to level three, and then pretty much straight to level four. Like within two days, she made the entire country go into lockdown, pretty much. And we've been inside for like, for, uh, this is week three now, as of tomorrow. We're coming on three weeks, yeah. and I think we've got a week more to go. Uh, and then, depending on the numbers, how it's all going, she might extend it. But we're looking at um, being able to go out again on the 22nd. As of now, I think we have like a thousand cases. We were at like 1,500, but you know, a third of them have recovered. And we've only got like nine deaths. We had like an another four yesterday. So that was a big shock. That was a big wake up call. Because yep. um, people were starting to slack after two weeks. There was a big uh, mass gathering on one of our beaches. So that was a big, like, yeah. you know, what the fuck you guys doing? Get, you know, stop and shoot and apparently there was also a stag party as well that was um that had some massive case like increase in cases of course. Uh, so that was like that wasn't cool um but yeah now we're doing really well um i absolutely absolutely applaud her she's done extremely well with a lot of uh crap that's happened you know with that that mosque mass shooting that happened last year in march yeah. um she handled that pretty well I'd say she's, yeah, she's doing well. At Defo, Jesus, yeah, I, fucking hell. Yeah, she's had a volcano go off, a uh, mass shooting in a mosque, and a fucking play to deal with. Yeah. So, and yeah. she's had a baby I, in amongst all that happening. Crazy. Well, holy yeah. shit. Well, fair play. Yeah, uh, just in the garden. So, um, yeah, I fuck, I love, like, these, like, we like mini podcasts that we have during, like, speedruns. It's pretty, <laughs> it's pretty good. But, yeah. It's yeah, good, yeah. Pretty, yeah, it's good. No, I'm I'm fucking thrilled that you're going to be coming out of it uh, soon. It gives hope to the rest of the world. I'd like to think because Ireland has been kind of a good response. Could have been a bit better in some respects, but I think we done pretty well. Um, yeah, better than the UK at least. Which is... Bojo's a maniac. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, yes, so that's why he got coronavirus and fucking going around shaking hands with people. So uh, there you go. Shake hands with everyone. Yeah, that, that was it. Yeah, I shook hands with everyone. Uh, I, I, I even shook, shook hands with hands with people with coronavirus. It's like, oh, there you if go. If you get the coronavirus, it's my, it's not your fault. Yeah. <laughs> that was actually a decent yeah. impression. Okay. <laughs> um, but yeah, so where's the speed run? Uh, James Jones, how are you getting on? Uh, I'm in Zephyr. Good. Uh, James Jones, what oh, do you think? Yeah. Boris, Boris Johnson, by the way. Uh, what what do I think? Yeah. yeah. Um, I, well, I, I, I don't really, I, 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 well, like, personally or politically or? Uh, uh, anyway, I guess. Uh, let's go with personally, perhaps, yes. Uh, Most controversial. I don't think I've ever really No, that's Trump. <laughs> <laughs> no, Bo Boris is a lot more likable than Trump. Yeah, no, I agree with that. Yes, I would say so. Um, oh, another question is, I'll, I'll ask Lucas where he is in a bit. Uh, who would you vote for in the uh, Welsh elections, uh, James? Are you a Plaid Cymru guy? Are you a Welsh Conservative Party? Or are you Welsh, Welsh Lib Dems? Um, um, I, uh, I, uh, I, 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 um, uh, Kimru, good man. Okay, then, right, yes. I'm going to uh, take the Plaid Kimru. All the politicians are shite. <laughs> <laughs> yes, uh, James Jones with Plaid Kimru, good man, I am too, yes, fuck it, Welsh independence, we want it now, and anyway, yes, yeah, so Lucas Bolton, where are you in the speedrun? Um, I, I'm just facing um, Bombo and um, uh, Scotch, cool, cool. Okay, so I think cool. I'm almost 100% Scotch to be fair. Yes, nice, good stuff, and then James Jones, you're 100% hundred percent Zephyr now. Yeah, I, I doubt if I'll actually manage to 100%. Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, give it a go. Uh, it is a, a goal of the speedrun, so, um, yeah. You didn't kill any of the caterpillar fodder in Zephyr, did you? Oh, I, I, well, um, um, I, uh, I, uh, I have now, yeah. Oh, no, you <laughs> monster! 
Ah, I think the worst yeah, part of Re I think the worst part of Reunited Trilogy was renaming Bombo. Bombo, yeah. Oh, what, there's, is, no, there's no need for that. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, I um, I agree. Uh, I, I wish they just kept it the same way. I'm kind of a bit old school in that. I could see why they did, but like, yeah, I'm just fucking leave him as Bombo. Like, it's, it's it, he throws bombs. I mean, it's not like he's like, called like, Kanto. <laughs> Well, I mean, I guess, you know, the, the I understand where they're coming from. Like, yeah. you think it's like an Ar Arab stereotype and it's like, OK, well, if you're I guess if it's a kid's game, like, like, I can understand it. And if it were me, I would probably make that decision, too. But begrudgingly, in a sense, I wouldn't want to. But um, but yeah, I'd, um, I couldn't understand it, uh, you know, causing offense to, to people. So, you know, it is what it is, I guess. But sure, look, um, here you go. Uh, it's just you know, their prerogative, but your luck. Uh, here, here we are. That's the world we live in today. Um, but yeah, so, so James, James, you haven't been to uh, Scorch or anything. You went to Scalos, then you went to Zephyr. Is that correct? Yeah, uh, yeah. I went somewhere before as well, but I can't remember where it was. Um, <laughs> yeah. James, yeah, uh, you'll notice probably. as well that there's a lot of lights in this save file because I was wasting my time trying to practice proxy jumps. What the hell have I- I just exited. What? Sorry. Oh, no. <laughs> I thought he was getting mad at you for doing proxy jumps. It's like, what? You're proxy oh, jumps no. doing proxy jumps? What? <laughs> Unbelievable. To be fair, I was getting mad that I wasn't getting proxy jumps, right? <laughs> Do you know that proxy jumping is is prohibited in Wales? So that's why he got very mad at you there. Ah, uh, yes, that makes sense. Yeah. You're not allowed to proxy jump in within the Welsh border, so um, so you have to go. If you want to do proxy jumps, you have to go to like Chester or Shrewsbury, and then you can you can do it. But um, nah, otherwise, no, absolutely not. Um, here I'll show my <laughs> flex of my UK geography knowledge. Um, but yeah, cool. Uh, sounds like Lucas is probably ahead here. He's going to have his first 100% level. Probably, yeah, yeah. Probably. yeah. Uh, I've already 100 uh, percent Scotch. Like, yeah, probably. <laughs> I've um, 100% of, Scotch, um, now I'm in Zephyr. Uh, sorry, uh, Zed, you were going to say? Ah, uh, all good. Uh, on the topic of proxy jumps, can anyone do the um, one in Spire of Three? Uh, what's the, what's one of the first levels in um, Sunny Springs? Hang on, so let me just look it up. I actually completely forgot. Spring, um, that, the Mano place. With the Sunrise Spring. Rice Spring. Are you talking about Sunny Villa? Yeah, Sunny Villa. Yeah, you know the the proxy jump where you jump on one of the cowardly Rhinox and you launch yourself up into the sky. I vaguely remember it. Yeah, uh, I. Yes, I. I know that well because I remember there was like a call where I was trying to do that like multiple times and I did actually get it but like I could never nail it like the professionals do um, but yeah I did yeah. do it I've done it a few times but like it's like it's like kind of like I get like one in 100 or maybe one in like 200 attempts or something yeah well fuck honestly I was so surprised when I was versing Wally like that was the video where I got uh, knocked out in the knockout tourney I actually managed to do it Oh, nice. First try. Nice. Um, but I'd been practicing for like a week or so. And I was really sick at that time. Like I had like a really bad flu. So I was just like bedridden for like a week or two. And I was just practicing that over and over and over again. And I can't, I can't do it anymore. I can't do it. I tried. Oh, I just can't do it. Yeah. That, that's, a, that's a shame. Uh -huh. sure oh, is that the... Um... Um, what was it again? I'm uh, sorry. I had to exit the call and rejoin. Ah, uh, that's okay. I was just talking about this like impossible proxy jump, and I was just proud of myself for a moment. But sure now you? I yeah. just just can't do it anymore. At least you, know? you were able to do it, Anvil. Fair play. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. I was I was I like suggested to Wally that we do this all you know all in proxies whatever. Um. And then I immediately regretted it. I was like, oh God, no, I'm going to completely <laughs> embarrass run. the heck out of myself in this run. Like, I'm going to lose, but I want to, you know, go out doing well. And I don't think this was a good idea. But surprisingly, it, it, it went well. 
considering I wasn't too far behind. I'll think it's about two, mate. I can still see the dust on the horizon that was Wally. Yes, you probably made him go, no, Wally. Yeah. Yes. Anyway, gas prices, am I right? All right. (laughs) (laughs) You said gas. 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 No, gas. Brum, brum. Brum, brum fuel. Yeah. Uh, James. No, I just... Yeah. (laughs) Yeah. Uh, come on, I'm just checking out that uh, link to the Blast Street Kitchen. And I'm like really hungry all of a sudden. Like it's not even lunchtime yet. And I've recently had breakfast, but now I really want tacos and just like. I, um, I want to say tuckers. <laughs> tuckers. I really want yeah. tuckers, you know? Yeah. Or just, just any food yeah. from a food truck. From a food truck, I like it. Yeah. Are you getting like trucks delivered to you? Street food? Uh, no, we're not. I mean, we've got like um, a few grocery stores that do uh, online deliveries. We do have that available. Um, and it was so Just bad. Eat? Sorry, you got Just Eat? Right, man. No, no, we don't. Unfortunately, um, oh, it Just Eat. Yeah. Yeah, but now uh, it's it's weird because um, the online grocery services they had to close them for a day because oh, yeah. too many people were panic online shopping, and this was before the lockdown, mm. <laughs> which is like everyone was just in s- such hysteria. People were just like staying away from everyone, which is you know I suppose good I guess. Yeah, the, yeah, Ireland luckily. People didn't freak out that much, but in the UK, FO people were fucking going crazy initially. So yeah, it was pretty bad. Um, yeah, so, like you could see like video of people like queuing at sort of like Tesco and stuff like with, like their yeah, that happened here. Yeah, yeah like, quite severely. Yeah, right, exactly. So crazy. Yeah, uh, Lucas, I imagine you're getting through Steph right now. Uh, yeah, um, I'm, I'm just getting through Steph right now, yeah. Well, how far along do you think you are? Well, I've, I've got like um, like half of the gyms, so I'm not far away from getting them all, and I'm, I'm doing like the first orb mission, and that's, that seems to be going quite well. Nice, good stuff. Okay, then. All right, looks like you've... You're ahead of uh, old Mr. Jones. Uh, James, You, how far along are you? Are you close to completing Zephyr 100% now? Uh, I can't acknowledge Zephyr anymore. I realize you need the training ability for that point. So I'm trying to uh, avoid that. Good. <laughs> yeah, I'm just trying to... Uh, nice. Mr. Bolton? Hmm? Looks like you got this in the bag, but uh, I don't want to speak too soon uh, in case Mr. Jones. I don't want to speak too out. soon, but it looks like I'm doing well for a change. Uh, yeah. Oh, uh, nice man. Yeah, this is. So this is your. How many speedruns have you done now? Four. Is, it, is it three? Four. Nice. Fair play. Holy shit. You can. Uh, yeah, you're gonna get a shout out in the next ISGP cast as uh, the most active runner, perhaps. So. Uh, okay. Yeah. Very good. Uh, yeah, we used to do awards in the old. Uh, um, yeah, by SGP. Oh, yes. Uh, really? Proactive speedrun. Yeah, no yeah, yeah. Runner, awkward speedrun. Uh, most proactive group. Lazy group. Yeah. Um, <laughs> That's awesome. Those are, it was a lot of fun. Uh, I remember the, the slowest runner was the, the Machine King Award for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. no, I, I, thought, I thought it was the Machine yeah. King was the biggest fail. Oh, sorry. Yes, good, good show, Connor. Yeah, the big, the biggest fail was the Machine King Award <laughs> because I think he uh, in IS3 he tried to cut his footage together and cheat. Oh, so, yeah. oh no! Yeah, oh. yeah oh. Well, he's, he's over that now. He's he's, he's in the tournament in yeah. Caliber 2012, uh, and he has gone over that. He's a new man. So. Um, yeah, also a very famous uh, Team Fortress 2 editor. Um, he has... How many subscribers does he have now? Like, uh, I lost. <laughs> yeah, he has uh, 90,000 subscribers. Damn, <laughs> oh, that's good. Shit. Yeah. 
I made loads of Team Fortress 2 um, videos. And uh, yeah, he fucking made a killing with like um, subscribers. Honestly, he's probably. He's like the person I would least have expected to make it big on YouTube. But uh, yeah, he's he's done pretty well for himself. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, it's good. It's proof that you can love your dreams. This. Oh man, he is, uh, yeah, he is some character. I look forward to more runs with him. Um, he nearly knocked me out of IS6. Let's not forget the tournament that I won. I wouldn't have won it if he had beaten me in that speed run. Um, yeah. I, beat him, I beat him by about 20 seconds, uh, I think. Uh, Damn, so, dude. Yeah, it's pretty close. Good stuff. Um, yeah, that was, uh, I was watching it back recently and it's just fucking insane because like we were making fun of like bronies and stuff. Uh, so you know, oh, like, yeah. <laughs> um, it's called, if you want to watch it, it's called, uh, it's DAFH013 versus Pinkie Pie. Uh, I didn't call him Machine King, I called him Pinkie Pie because he said Pinkie Pie was his favorite character. Yeah. <laughs> and, um, yeah, uh, the, the whole speed run like Ratchet and Angus were just making fun of like, like skaties and brownies and like all this shit. Oh. So, uh, <laughs> Oh my god, do you remember like uh, when he faced the Platform King in IS-8 and the loser lost the name King in their name, so for the rest, for the rest uh, of the run, you say it's, it's the machine. <laughs> yes, he became the machine, yes, I remember that. Isn't that a yeah. comedian? Yeah. Uh, yeah, most likely, yeah, the machine. Mm. The machine. Yes, yes, I, I, I do remember that. That was, uh, that was pretty fucking gas. Yeah, um, yeah. I gotta watch that back. That was, that was fucking. I love that stipulation. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> oh, we had some good times, eh? Um, but yeah, nah, it was good. Very good. Oh, cool. Like, this is this is really nice and chill. Like for you, it's on the gamble. Obviously, it's like around lunch time, but for us, it's like twenty to for all of us here. Actually, it's twenty to one a.m. Uh, so, yeah. yeah like, heading to sleep soon, and then I'm gonna wake up at like eight fifty a.m. to work at nine a.m. It's just gonna be uh, great. Do you, so, so uh, do you like do you like work from your like bedroom, like or, like uh, like kitchen, or like do you have to or do you have to go into the place? I just stay at home and stay in my bedroom and I work until 5pm and then I go on Discord and have fun that's uh, my life for the last few weeks so yeah uh, that's it um, I make calls um, from my laptop I you know, monitor leads on Salesforce and um, yeah um, and I have meetings and and all from the confines of my um from my bedroom so um, so that's it uh work has really not been affected for me um it's probably not as good as i'd like it to be because i in my office i have like another big screen that i can use but um it's it's fine um you know it, i'm happy to still have a job right so uh yeah it's great um, it's absolutely fine oh, i just found it was the machine uh but <laughs> Chrysler, I think. I just um, in the voice chat spam put a link to the uh, this, <laughs> this uh, <laughs> Russian mafia story. Yeah, uh, as like a teenager or something in no. high school, or whatever. He was learning Russian, and he was one of those kids who just didn't show up to class and learn every anything all year. Anyway, he went to Russia as part of a school trip, and he learned through experience. And he ended up getting involved with the the mafia and was like drinking like real booze in it up with the mafia, and that's how he learned Russian. He thought they call him the machine. These these big Russian mafia boys. That is amazing. Yeah, it's. Wow, it's we didn't know we were getting a mafia story in this run. <laughs> I don't do the story any justice. I recommend you go watch it yourself. But mafia, so hilarious. We need to, we need to learn more about that that guy. Yeah. He inadvertently helped the Russian Mafia mob rob a train while on a college ship to Russia. Yo, I gotta fuck, I'm gonna... Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's good. It's yeah, I'm really gonna good. I'm gonna check that out, that's fucking gas. <laughs> yeah. Also, is anyone watching, like, Tiger King? I know, like, the whole internet... Yeah, I've like, seen that. about that at the moment. Okay, I've seen cool. quite a bit of it, yeah. Who do you think uh, Tiger King would go for out of uh, that, that sweet, sweet Brez picture of Angus and Andrew? Probably Andrew. Probably Andrew. Because <laughs> he's, well, he's a bit leaner. 
<laughs> ah. Yes. Fair enough. Yep. Good yeah. call, good call. That's fair. That's fair. Uh, I'm a hipster, so I I haven't been watching it. I like it is. I'm, I'm a I'm such a fucking hipster. Like if if people at work are all watching <laughs> something, I'm like I'm, I'm not gonna watch it. Like I decide if, if the world's watching, I'm not watching. Like, the meat. The... So you haven't watched Game of Thrones? Is that what you're saying? No Game of ah, Thrones. I haven't I watched watch that either. To be fair, I, I I didn't watch Making a Murder. Thank you. Um, I, I didn't watch Making a Murder when everyone was freaking about Making a Murder. Like, yo, I'm just not gonna watch this. I dude. haven't watched that actually. Uh, that, so, yeah, this, know, yeah. little... this situation feels similar to that. With, like the Tiger thing. Yeah, actually, yeah, it, it is, isn't it? Yeah, it reminds me a lot of that whole Making. The, a there is like thing. allegations on both sides mm. that she feed her her husband to a lion, for example. Or tiger. So, I don't. I don't know. Fuck it. But yeah. It's Joe Exotic guy still. Oh wait, I I fucking I think I read about him before this documentary. Actually, now that I think about it, yeah. Um, kill big. Oh whoa, yo. Oh wow, I actually I really want to watch this now. I'm not gonna lie. Um, his surname Schreibvogel. Writing bird. Okay, it's a really interesting surname. Um, okay, um, yeah, actually, I might, I might check it out. Why not? That'd be, yeah, yeah, maybe I will. Maybe I will top on the bandwagon. So. Maybe I should. Um, yeah, eight-part documentary. Where did Mayhem and Latin School? Yeah, yeah, I might. Grand. Um, are you? How are you in Zephyr at the moment, uh, Lucas? Um, I, I can't seem to find the last Kula. <laughs> He's um, murdered all the caterpillars like a madman. Probably. Um, yeah, Lucas. How oh, there he is. Could you? There's, there's, there's the wee, the wee oh. fella. <laughs> there's the wee fella. That's a, good... <laughs> a wee lad. Lad. There's the wee fella. Come here, laddie. I, I should remind you that you do have to finish in the next, I think, um... five minutes. Go, 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 quick. Not, not five minutes, but definitely like within half an hour because there was a <laughs> yeah, hour, yeah, I should be able minutes. to do that under half an hour, so on quite well. Nice. It sounds like if you if you got the Catholics out of the way, then you're you're on the home stretch with Zephyr. So um, yeah, nicely done. Piddle to the middle, quick, go the, fast. The girl like might have respond though. <laughs> respond. He may respond back to where, where he originally was because I can't see him. Or, or maybe uh, he went on the ground, actually. Yeah, they, they don't um, respawn. Um, so yeah, they, they maybe he's just on the, on the ground or something. Or maybe the emulator glitched him out. Oh, the few. That's interesting. <laughs> yeah, it was, yeah. Oh, there he is. There you go. Uh, James, how are you getting on? Oh, I'm in, uh, uh, what's it called? Scorch now. Oh, yeah. shit. Did you go after 100%? Oh, no, no, I haven't done it. You have to 100% both I mean, the levels. Yeah, uh, James, you have to complete the <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> oh, I don't know if that. Oh, sorry, James, but them's the rules. Oh, God. <laughs> <Damn> <laughs> <the rules. laughs> he is right. Uh, James, you can complete Scorch 100% and then go back to Zephyr. And... Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, and then you can complete that uh, 100% when you go back to it. So, yeah, it, it's it's fine. Let's just say you're kind of splitting your time in the two levels. So, yeah, all um... right. I ended it without the, uh, was it the, uh, the thing. Um... Oh, what the hell is that? Oh shit! I think my uh. Hang on, see. <laughs> your controls bust. I don't like the sound of those noises. Oh no! <laughs> your controller has been a wank. Has my controller stopped working? Oh, yeah, I think I think it has. I think it has. But your controller has been. Oh no, no, it's it's worked again. Oh, yes. Yes. great. <laughs> Uh, how, did, hey. how did that happen? Welcome back oh. to the race. Welcome back, James, to the race. Very good. Um, good Grant, so Lucas, you've uh, got the Calyx um, 
sorted now, I assume. Yeah, it's just the just the um the last um the talisman and then uh, the last of the gems. Man. And then Man. I should have enough for Scotch to be able to open for Scotch gems. No, sorry, sorry, sorry. Shady Oasis, my bad. They kind of look similar. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, yeah. Well, good point because they're originally uh, on the the article of the road. Both um, Scorch and Shady Oasis were going to be like twin levels, and um, Scorch was going to be Scorch Dune, and Shady Oasis was going to be Scorch Oasis. So uh, yeah, similar, but they were going to be March in Cloud Temples as well. Was going to have something. They were going to be twin yeah. joined. Oh yes, yeah, yeah, but, yeah, Mystic, yeah, that's Mystic right. City. And Mystic Savannah. Yeah. Alright, James. Alright, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Uh. <laughs> well, well, I'm okay. <laughs> uh, <laughs> well, well, I mean, I'm, I'm losing the speed run, but apart from that, everything's great. <laughs> uh, I, I, th- I think you might have this one, Lucas. Yeah. Lucas, you got the vote of confidence from James Jones. I don't know, maybe he's trying to make you have a false... James Jones, I, I'm, I don't trust you. Oh. <laughs> I think you may be throwing me off, so I'll become complacent in my skills. It's one of the things uh, my games these tournaments, you know, getting people to be complacent, saying, oh, I'm not doing very well, and then out of nowhere, oh, I finished the speedrun. <laughs> No, that's just that's just yes, Wally one. Like as soon as the the race starts. No, yes, Wally one just does this silence, and then he's like, "Oh, I finished." Yeah, it's <laughs> just like, like that. can we? It's like, can we get a countdown? Three, two, one, go. Five seconds later, Wally's like, "All right, I'm done." <laughs> or or he just doesn't say anything. Just like like lets us all just talk for like fifteen minutes. He's like, "Oh yeah, I finished like I half an hour ago." I remember the first ever speed run I did in back in IS6 and like uh, it was against Rabbit and um, he didn't really say much during the speed run. I think he said he was ahead. I was like, are you serious? And then I was like, oh, that's why he does so well. He doesn't, doesn't even talk in the speed run. <laughs> Guys, come on. There it is. It's right here. Yeah. He's a man of focus, pure will and determination. And that uh, I don't care if I talk as long as I win the speed run. Pretty much, yeah. The less you talk, <laughs> the more chance you have of winning. I think Charm Sky was proof of that. So, was that last bit you said? I think I cut out. Oh, um, I think, uh, yeah, the less you talk, the more chance you have of winning. And Charm Sky uh, didn't talk much in the, la- in the last run, and I think that was favourable for her. Ah, oh, right, yeah. Did you catch yeah, me there, like, yeah? Um, Lucas Stone Shade, I love Multitasking, it. yeah. Um, that's why I'm here. I, I make sure, especially if someone doesn't talk all that much, I make sure to actually ask them a lot of questions so they have to talk. And that's actually yeah. something I, I try to do. And I got her to talk, I think, more than she may have <laughs> usually would. So uh, it worked out quite well. Um, yeah. But. Um, but yeah, I, yeah, I'm usually conscious of that of that very fact, uh, Lucas. That yes, um, talk, no talking does equal perhaps better performance sometimes. And, uh, yeah, well, I, I tried to do the no talking thing, but it doesn't work out to me. So. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I try to keep quiet, but I just can't stop. The thing with me is, I enjoy talking too much, so I tend to just uh, yeah. my gob anyway. So yeah. To be fair, James is actually right. He doesn't talk about much in these speedruns, and yeah, it doesn't usually result in much success. So. <laughs> James Jones, you're losing my confidence here, pal. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think it's a big thing, Mike, is with you. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, honestly, this is probably the, James. It's probably the most I've heard you talk like in a speedrun, like without any like issues or glitches. Like you should probably join on your phone more often. Like you've been. Yeah, I think I'll do, I'll do that for now. One, yeah. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Yeah, I definitely noticed that I'm talking a lot more because, like, in speedruns I do, I definitely I try to talk, but I'm always like, uh, uh, or I'm like tripping over myself, and I'm not like properly 
formulating sentences before I say them. <laughs> well, so my commentary, way. when it is there, is garbage. I realize Sorry. that... We were actually talking, we were talking about that recently, uh, Zed, um, actually, in another speedrun about that exact fact, and Johnny was asking me, like, um, is Spyro a good game to, like, speedrun and talk and I, and I told him like when I raised Angus in I in ISGP the original like there was 50 minutes of back and forth dialogue between us but I couldn't I was on autopilot the entire time I was just saying words and not really I like when the, when the speedrun finished I couldn't remember anything I said like it was just words just came out of my mouth but I couldn't actually remember what I was saying so it's kind of what you're describing like everything was coming out of my mouth I wasn't it was just words which yeah. I wasn't really thinking about yeah. like it was just autopilot shit and so I probably sounded very stupid at times and a lot of people like uh, uh duh but I just wasn't thinking like it's just words just flying in my mouth so um yeah I totally agree uh, I know what you're saying um it's it's interesting though um so I can understand why people therefore are quiet but um I think that uh you know people need entertainment value yeah, and, uh, yeah. I, I agree with so, you yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes. Mm. it's either because I can't I'm multitask not. or or hear me out, I might sound a bit crazy, but it's the speedrunning gods. They're like possessing us when we run. Yeah. They're like channeling their power. I, I like that theory. I like that theory yeah. a lot. This happens to stubborn bastard. I always make a sacrifice. Yeah. He, he can yeah. turn six foot and yet he's scared of tiny little enemies. Same. So, what did you say? Yeah. Six foot, that's what I heard. The wee hippo can go six foot, but yeah, he needs a small little dragon to defeat the enemies. That's right. Ah, yeah. uh, yes, yeah. Tito's, yes. Looks yeah. like Lucas is on the home stretch then, so. I think so, yeah. It's looking good. You're about to do the, the Baz challenge, or Yeah, I'm doing it now. So we're not allowed to do, I mean, no, we being the, not me, the, the runners, uh, well, they're not allowed to do Reignited Trilogy runs, right? They're not doing it this, uh, this tourney? Yeah, I'm not sure. I, I think that, uh, I, yeah, I don't think it, I think it is focused on the original, but the I was right. wondering, I was wondering if the... Was... Oh, sorry, you continue. No, sorry. no, 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 continue, Zed. No, no, you're fine. Okay, I, I was gonna say I think I heard Fisher say like uh, Reignited's had its time in the light, and we're gonna bring it back to OG. Okay, yeah, I can kind of see the the sense in that. So yeah, fair enough. Um, yeah, okay, fair. Um, I personally, I already don't care what people you know race as long as it's something Spyro. Uh, so yeah. if it's really Reignited, then that'd be fine by me too. But sure, look, uh, that's just me. I kind of think yeah. that Reignited. It would take a lot of the glitch stuff away, which I kind of like. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, I definitely. Yeah, that, that's what I was like thinking. Like I was hopeful that the reignited would be an option. If it if it isn't, um, yeah, so that's me done. Be, because like yeah, there are like harder glitches, but it opens up the opportunity to really liven up the. Uh, the gameplay footage because there's like all the different mods and stuff, you know. So you like get all sorts of different drag. Dragons race. I read that. Uh, that's me complete. Um, oh, well done. Oh, um, well done, Lucas. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> when I win our chicken dinner. Very good. <laughs> Goodbye, Lucas. Scotland has the most Well, he he. After lucky, but Scotland's have won another speedrun. Yes, very good. So, well, we too. Nice. so that's the British Royals speedrun for you there. Um, so James Jones takes the fall. Lucas Bolton and uh, well done, Lucas. Uh, you clocked in, I think, in about 50 minutes. So, no draw here. Um, you just managed to get it within the time frame. So, that's good. Uh, and uh, yeah, so, um that was a lot of fun. Thanks, um, Zed and Mr. Game Cindy for joining me. I um, thoroughly enjoyed that, that, um, that chat. Yes, yeah, so it was good. It was very good. Um, it's probably going to be another speedrun that I'm going to 
in 10 years time when I'm on a flight, a really long flight, I'm going to download this video and put it on my phone and watch it back, which is um, as sad as it sounds is what I do with old speedruns. No, I'm kind of saying I'm they have installed it. Who needs, who needs Netflix when you can just download speedruns? Exactly. Like when you're downloading exactly. memories, man, it's... Netflix, good. we're coming for you. Watch out. Look, it's yeah. only has to win one more speed or now, and he's won more matches than Scotland in the Six Nations this year. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> you look right. Fish, I'm still in the final. <laughs> well, there you have it. So, uh, yeah, cheers, uh, James. Uh, we're just gonna we would encourage people to finish but we'd be here all night so, <laughs> uh, so yeah end it there instead oh, i'll stop uh, recording cool. my obs in a, in a couple of seconds Perfect. all right well in that case then goodbye everyone and uh, thank you for joining and we'll see you again soon bye everyone uh, uh, have a good day have a good night